Hello LGs, ladies and gents, this is the lady. I am back with some more wigs for you guys. So if you're interested in seeing them, then of course continue to watch. Alright, so before I show you guys the um, the wigs that I have right here, just got in, I wanted to come in and just do an update on the unit I'm wearing. This is my Peruvian uh, wavy unit. I love this unit, okay? At first, I must admit, I didn't like the hair. I thought it was too dollish, kind of. I hope you guys know what I'm talking about. When I'm talking about doll hair, it was just really soft, really kind of shiny. It came with a side part that I couldn't get rid of. And I washed it like twice and that's how I was able to get that permanent part that it came in out and, um, and okay don't laugh but I actually hung the wig outside on a clothes pin with clothes pins you know and just let all the hair fall back and just you know I just put it up on clothes pins and that's how I got rid of that part okay yes I know country <laughs> but it worked and so um, and now after you know wash after washing it for like um, two or three times is it's beautiful it's so much more realistic looking for me now and what I really like about this Peruvian okay hair I, I can't tell you if it's true Peruvian or not that's what they say it is so I'm just gonna say Peruvian but um, what I really like about it is all women any woman can wear this hair it is not um, it's not too thick European to wear it's not too uh, too slick or um, silky for African Americans or people of color with thicker strands of hair to wear. Everyone can wear this kind of hair. Absolutely gorgeous. Okay, now mine is looking a little rough because I just come from um, the store and it's been wind blown, but this is the way I love it. Okay, this is just the way I love my hair to look messy, kind of bedhead hair. So, um, I love it this way and the hair it, it's just perfect for this climate I'm in in California it is perfect okay it's just goes with the weather I mean I can be on the beach and get it a little damp and it just gets into these beautiful beautiful waves or I can be riding my bike and start to perspire and the waves are just gorgeous. I mean, the hair just doesn't look bad no matter what I do. I was playing tennis in it. I was riding my bike in it. I sleep in it sometimes. Okay, this is this is absolutely gorgeous. And for me at my age, I feel like this is the right length. It is 16 inches, so it's just a perfect length for... Um, women over 40 okay I do have another unit that's like 22 inches yeah so I'll be showing you guys that and I have a unit that um, I think is 20 inches so I'm gonna show you both of those after I finish doing the update is the glueless cap wig that is true that's really a full lace wig with combs okay it really isn't the true glueless cap which is what I love because I don't have to wear tape or liquid adhesive with my true glueless cap wigs but with this particular one it comes with cones one on each side and one all the way back here you guys okay all the way like in the center or crown in my head all right don't understand why they put a comb all the way back there but that's the way it came and it has the straps in the back now this one is too big for me and I don't have the straps hooked in because if I was to hook the straps I would I would have to hook them all the way you know to the 
very um, tightest point and then you have that little bump in the back and I don't like that little bump so I just unhook them and just let it lay flush to my nape area but I don't have it taped down or anything because I don't normally pull my hair up in a ponytail or a high bun so I can get away with not um, adhering it down in the back. So yeah, so I do have it adhered down with tape in the front because like I said, just, um, like I said, it's not a true glueless cap. So I have to adhere it down with tape, otherwise it wouldn't, um, it wouldn't stay flush to my, um, my hairline. Let's have the wispy hairs, okay? And these are true wispy hairs, okay? Not bangs that you see on loving the thickness the fullness of it it's supposed to be a hundred and thirty percent density which is a nice you know um, thickness to the hair and it helps it just kind of stand out a little bit more instead of density even though it is thick in the around the hairline is the fact that it does give it volume you know it gives it volume when it's like this, it it gives it already, it gives it volume at the top. And I don't have to worry about, you know, trying to add products in it like um, some mousse or some kind of styling holding. All right, so that's the update on this unit. I love the, I love my virgin Peruvian uh, unit and um, 